Imagine walking into a museum and seeing something impossible, an artwork that never looks the same twice, created by artificial intelligence dreaming about nature. Sounds like science fiction? Well, that's exactly what we're exploring today. I'm Oleg G from Art Explained Simply and Quickly, and we're diving into one of the most mind-bending artworks of our time, Quantum Memories by Refik Anadol. This isn't your typical painting or sculpture. What you're looking at is a massive AI-generated artwork that spans 30 feet high and 15 feet wide, displaying ever-changing images that seem to flow like liquid dreams. But here's the incredible part. Every single moment you're watching is unique, never to be repeated again. Let me show you what makes this artwork so revolutionary. Created in 2020, Quantum Memories is powered by a sophisticated artificial intelligence that's been fed over 200 million images of nature. Think about that for a moment. 200 million photographs of landscapes, oceans, clouds, and forests. But instead of just showing us these pictures, the AI does something extraordinary. It dreams up entirely new versions of nature that have never existed before. Now, Here's where it gets fascinating. The AI isn't just randomly generating pretty pictures, it's actually learning from all these images, understanding patterns in nature, and creating what Anadol calls data paintings. These aren't static images. They're constantly morphing, flowing, and evolving right before our eyes. Did you know that this artwork also incorporates quantum computing data? That's right, Anadol collaborated with Google's quantum computing researchers to add another layer of complexity. The artwork uses quantum noise as one of its data sources, making it perhaps the first artwork in history to bridge the gap between quantum computing and artificial intelligence. Look closely at how the colors shift and blend. Sometimes you might see what looks like ocean waves, but they transform into cloud formations, then into abstract landscapes that defy description. It's as if you're watching nature itself evolving in real time, but through the dreams of a machine. Here's something mind blowing. The AI doesn't just create random patterns, it's actually learning and adapting as it generates these images. Think about that. We're not just looking at an artwork. We're watching an artificial intelligence interpret and reimagine our natural world. The scale of this piece is crucial to its impact. At 30 feet tall, it completely engulfs viewers in its ever-changing landscape. Anadol deliberately chose this massive size to create what he calls an immersive data sculpture. When you stand before it, you're not just looking at art, you're experiencing data in a physical, emotional way. But this artwork raises some fascinating questions about the future of art itself. Can a machine create genuine beauty? Is this collaboration between human and artificial intelligence the future of creativity? Anadol isn't just making pretty pictures. He's challenging our entire understanding of what art can be. Let's talk about the technical marvel behind this piece. The AI uses a type of machine learning called GANs, Generative Adversarial Networks. Think of it like having two AIs. One creates images, while the other judges them. They work together, constantly improving, learning what makes an image feel natural and meaningful. The quantum computing aspect adds another layer of unpredictability. Just like quantum particles exist in multiple states at once, this artwork exists in a constant state of possibility, never settling into a single form. It's literally bringing quantum uncertainty into the visual realm. What's particularly fascinating is how this artwork reflects our modern relationship with technology. We're all increasingly interacting with AI in our daily lives, often without realizing it. Quantum Memories makes this interaction visible, beautiful, and even a bit unsettling. The colors and patterns you see aren't random either. The AI has learned color relationships from those millions of nature photographs, understanding how light and shadow work in the natural world. It's like watching a machine's interpretation of every sunset, ocean wave, and mountain vista ever photographed all blending together in an endless dance. 
This brings us to a deeper question. What does it mean to be creative in an age of artificial intelligence? Anadol isn't replacing human creativity. He's expanding it, showing us new possibilities that emerge when we collaborate with machines. Think about how far we've come from cave paintings to canvas and now to quantum computing and AI. Yet this artwork still moves us emotionally, still makes us contemplate our place in the universe. Maybe that's what makes it truly revolutionary. If you'd like to understand and know more about art, follow this channel. And before you go, let us know in the comments which artwork you'd like to see explained next. Let's keep exploring the fascinating world of art together.